So today is another blazer, bootleg jeans and boots kind of day. Just one of my favorite ensembles because it is just so versatile, so simple. I'm in the office. I've got some Zoom calls. I've got a little bit of uh, video work on marketing copy to do. And then I'm at school as well, helping with the uh, hair and makeup for my little girl's production, which is very excited about. And so I'm opting for a simple, functional, practical, slightly fashionable ensemble that has stood the test of time. It is one of the oldest ensembles in the world. The blazer, the t-shirt or slash cami, bootleg jeans, a nice little belt, uh, some boots or heels or wedges, depending on the weather, uh, some basic accessories, con plot as always. And so I'm just going to grab my navy blazer because I do like navy and taupe. I did share previously with this blazer that navy is not a good color on me. So if there is something that you love in your wardrobe, but it just doesn't work with you. And this is for years now. Um, I bought a navy pantsuit in London years ago when I lived there. So I had it for like probably 15 years. Really nice navy three-quarter length uh, suit that I normally wear with a t-shirt, white tennis shoes for business casual. But the older I've got and the greyer I've got, uh, navy is too harsh on me unless I combine it with something like a taupe scarf or a really soft blush nude kind of top. Now, you can wear this on its own. So if it gets a bit warm, I would change the bra. If ever I'm going to wear something that we will see the bra underneath, then I'll always either put a t-shirt on or I make sure that the bra is um, a tone or two darker than the color that I'm wearing. Otherwise, it just kind of looks a little bit kind of like... You know, look here, here's my bra. So a darker one is better. That is definitely not warm enough to take my blazer off. This is about taking this dressing out of dressing because if you want to be like that rock star brand designer wear kind of, you know, labels only kind of dresser and that's your personal style, that's great. Everybody's different. No one can tell you you can't wear that. If you know what you're doing, yeah, go for it. Uh, but I am focused on the woman who wants to keep it simple, knows that style is a skill, uses the capsule wardrobe as a fundamental foundational concept to building a beautiful wardrobe, customized to your body, to your budget, to your lifestyle. And so you don't have to live in those yoga pants. You don't have to be wearing the same t-shirt and skinny jeans every single day. So all I'm going to do now is put my blazer on. I've got my trustees. I'm loving these complots. I tell you what, I've worn them so many times since I bought them. Uh, only a couple of months ago, but they're so light. And this is what Complot is about, is a uh, variety of both product and style as well as price. Um, all of her rings are adjustable so that if you've got, I have skinny wrists and skinny fingers and skinny ankles. Um, and so it's just catches the light. Remember, I talk about wearing something that is eye-catching, then it's conversation starting and relationship building. I have friendships, and in fact, one of my closest friends in my life, uh, who still lives in the UK, she and I connected uh, one time at church because of the like kind of ivory white coat I was wearing in winter. And she's like, man, that is a beautiful coat. And so the coat connected us. Would we have connected anyway? Probably. I have no doubt. Uh, but what you wear is an expression of you, an extension of you. So you want to think Ask yourself, like, what am I saying? Because you're in the fashion business, whether you like it or not, you're saying something, whether you like it or not, you want to know what you're saying. And oftentimes we think, oh, well, beauty is just on the inside and all the values on the inside. It doesn't matter what I'm wearing. That is just BS. We live in a world that recruits and rewards excellence and a spirit of competitiveness, a spirit of uh, honor and dignity and a spirit of winning. And so when you learn to dress on the outside that reflects all of that on the inside, you will draw new people and new opportunities into your life like that. So now I'm just going to get my blazer on. A navy staple, tailored, nice structured blazer is a huge part of your capsule wardrobe. And so you see it just brings tailoring. It's got nice uh, buttons on it. And so all I've got on is a slightly shimmery cami. I've got detail on the belt, a little bit of animal print. I have my uh, super comfy block ankle heels on, brown and navy. I prefer to black and navy. Um, and these jeans are actually a local brand, True Words, um, Outback Red. They're super, super comfortable. And then I'm just gonna grab my bag. Also local to South Africa. Uh, if you're coming to South Africa on our Spirit of Beauty VIP tour end of the year, 
you might just get one of these with a few goodies inside. This has got a few of my own things in, uh, my makeup bags to help with the production today, and I am good to go. PPS, because it probably will get warm enough when I take my scarf off around my neck and just leave it like this. I've added a couple of layers of love laid necklaces. I don't typically wear a lot of necklaces. I don't like fussy detail here. But if you take this away, you can see it can be a little bit blank, a little bit kind of, uh, I'm very gray. There's a lot of, I've got short hair and there's a lot of space between here and it all kind of can fade away and become a little bit insipid actually. So all you add is a couple of layers of necklaces and it just catches the light. It's the little things that make a difference with your style. You don't have to break the bank to look good and feel good. You don't have to take two hours in the morning. I can do everything in about 20, 25 minutes if I have to from the shower out the front door. I like to take 40, 45 minutes because then I've got time to think about stuff, answer a message or two while I'm at my dressing table doing my thing. But um, you do you. Make sure that you understand the staples in the capsule wardrobe like the blazer, the cami, uh, the black, the white tee, or the black or the navy tee, your bootleg jeans, your white tennis shoes. There are so many staples that will create hundreds, literally hundreds of different outfits for you if you just get the staples in place. It's like building a house. You have the foundations, you have the flooring, you know where the stairs are gonna go, you know where the, where the, where the windows are gonna go, you know the scaffolding around the roofing, and once that's all in place, then you come with your personal style, so that's the capsule wardrobe, all the basics in place. Then you come with your eye trained to understand your body shape. You understand what works for you in terms of color and style. And you add your own touch. Are you going to have swags and tails or Roman blinds? Same as in your closet. Are you going to have a navy blazer or do you want now to add a hot pink one? And that's how you build from the bottom up. The capsule wardrobe is just building blocks. So for now, I've got my cute little animal print. I'm going to wrap this up because it is chilly out there and I have a full day ahead of me as I'm sure you do as well. Have a good one.